So I just did my Shein haul. If you have not seen it, I will link it below. And I wanted to put some looks together with some items uh, that you guys wanted to see from that video. We're gonna style this uh, belt. I know it's daisies, but I'm probably gonna call it sunflowers like a million times. Something when I see white and yellow, my brain just farts and says sunflowers. Like maybe if you have some gas X for my brain, that would be perfect. I have definitely some daisy things. I think I actually have some sunflower things too. I wanna go not full on matchy matchy with this. I never advise to do that necessarily. Same with like a room, new living room. I wouldn't buy the living room suit, so to speak. It'll look much more eclectic otherwise. Since I do have some pieces, I wanna tie at least one thing. So I'm gonna start with that. I have no idea where I'm going with this. These videos are totally unplanned. I mean, come on. Come on now. I do believe that this is as matchy matchy as I would prefer to be. We're gonna halt it here with the flowers. I want it to not look overly girly girl. Not that I'm afraid for it to look girly girl, but I don't want it to look almost too little kid girly, if that makes sense. So I think the rest of the outfit, I'm gonna try to be edgier. So the first thing I'm thinking is let's do black pants. I actually didn't really envision a wide leg, however, I had these and they're new. I think these are fairly flattering. These are from Walmart, they're time and true. Size 16. And you know how I've talked about like the drop off? I feel like that's the general reason why wide leg pants don't always look the best on a hippie person, especially if you kind of prefer more fitted stuff. Obviously if I wanna just get a big old baggy loose pair of pants as wide as my widest saddlebag area, then it's fine. But I usually don't wanna do that. I have the belt on sort of loosely. I like the vibe, I like the vibe. Definitely wanna incorporate yellow in somewhere although i feel like i don't have much yellow so that's a challenge i'm struggling i do not have the right yellows i hardly have any yellow too cool tone of a yellow this one that i have here is almost like a, a thick butter type of a yellow and i don't know i just feel like i need almost like a light marigold this is what it's gonna have to be despite being the wrong yellow i really really like this i did the whole kind of tuck and flap thing i kind of folded this interesting because when you put it through it sort of doesn't show the flowers. I'm gonna add something else, but I feel like I want it to be sort of minimal. I think the flowers are a big enough statement in this look that I think it carries the look. So let's get a couple more simple accessories. Accessories. I think we have what I'm gonna call the final look. So stack some bracelets here, sort of more of like a chain that has a little bit of edginess. As you can see, it's like studded and then the yellow. I did add my new Shein um, anklet here, which is also a chain. And I just went with like my favorite moto jacket from Scoop in a size large from Walmart. I really like the way this turned out. I love my retro glasses. I have these now in gold and silver. The silver hardware started out here and it actually sort of all worked out. The shoes have silver hardware. This, it all has silver hardware. I put a necklace on. I didn't really like it. I tried several. I didn't really like it, but as always, let me know. Let me know how to make this look better. But this is for now what I'm gonna call the final look. I just realized I don't even have a bag. Oops.